Well, I've got a question for Robin based on something that you said earlier tonight. When you began writing as Robin Hobb, did Megan Lindholm's voice change at all? <laughs> um, not really, because uh, I, I think when I, when I began to write the Fit stories, even though I had not at that point contemplated doing a, a change in pseudonym, um, I had already decided on a different storytelling voice for them. Um, they're, they're, you know, we all, we all have our different storytelling voices and, and whether you reach back in your mind and you hear in a high and far off time, O oh best beloved, which is Rudyard Kipling, or you, or you hear um, something, you know, from Dr. Seuss, you know, uh, it, all these different storytelling voices. So I knew that when I began writing Farseer, I wanted to use a different voice, a more measured voice. Um, so that, that voice became the, the voice I use as Robin Hobb for my stories. Uh, not necessarily Fitz's voice, obviously, if I'm writing uh, the Soldier Sun trilogy, but that more measured kind of storytelling. Whereas Make and Lindholm will still um, jump into the middle of the action and just expect the writer to race along and catch up. So it, it, I don't think it really changed at all. <laughs>